Weather. Let's talk heat. Oh. How much of the weekend is going to feel like kind of like today and yesterday? It's better. We're, we're past the worst of it. We're going to still be humid going into tomorrow, Doug. Our temperatures are going to feel maybe like the triple digits, but we don't have the heat advisory extended into Saturday. Right now, after a day with our temperatures topping out at 96 degrees, we're sitting in the upper 80s. It is 89 in Dallas to 86 in McKinney. You can see all of our reporting stations across North Texas in the mid to the low 80s in the southeast. So we're dealing with. Still so warm temperatures tonight. It is still is muggy stepping on out of the door. Uh, when you factor in the humidity, it still feels almost like 100 at Love Field. It feels like 97 in Granbury to 93 in Sherman to 97 in Greenville. So we are dealing with really humid conditions tonight, but also a breezy evening with our winds remaining out of the south to the southeast between 15 to 25 miles per hour. So it tries to cool you off a bit. Feels kind of like a hair dryer at times, but uh, we'll take any breeze we can get because man. Have we been pretty warm? Right now in the future sky forecast, not a whole lot happening for us. We're remaining relatively quiet. So overnight tonight, under partly cloudy to mainly clear skies, our temperatures cool down into the upper 70s. Tomorrow we'll see 78 degrees, then warm up to about 93 to 94. Late in the day, a 20% chance of some isolated showers popping up. Maybe a couple of isolated storms. Still a breezy day with our winds out of the south near 15 to 25. So the feels like temperature tomorrow morning in the mid 80s, and we are going to be seeing at times it feel close to 100 degrees into the afternoon, but not as oppressive as what we saw today. Next couple of days, our rain chances do increase. On Sunday, a 40% rain chance. Early on Monday, 70% chance of rain and even some strong to possibly severe storms. So let's put the future sky forecast in motion. You see the cloud cover in place for tomorrow into tomorrow night. Some storms developing well out to the west, then working close to North Texas and trying to just brush our Red River counties into the overnight hours. That's complex number one that we're looking at. Then going into Sunday afternoon, a couple of showers and storms off towards the north. East, but I want to show you this complex that's pushing its way southeast. That's the one to be worried about. That has the potential overnight Sunday into Monday to strong for strong winds for us. After that, we cool down into the 80s into next week.